Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the healing room. This is not my normal location, um, but I wanted to do a quick post. I will not be doing the normal session this morning. I am excited because I get to go meet my new nephew for the first time. Um, so that's a, a big life event. So that's what I'll be doing. Um, Wednesday, I hope to have a guest speaker. And then next week, um, I will not be doing the healing room because I will be doing a motorcycle tour. That is the plan with Chariots of Light Christian Bikers. Um, so if you're looking for me next week, you won't find me. Um, I am also planning on changing some of the times for the healing room. Um, and But I'll keep you posted on that. So anyway, just a quick word um, from the word. Proverbs 4 is the key. Um, it's called God's Medicine Bottle. Um, that's one of the books by Derek Prince, God's Medicine Bible. You know, Kenneth Hagin talks about this. Gloria Copeland talk about it. And this is the key to your healing. Is my son, attend to my words, incline your ear to my sayings, let them not depart from your eyes, keep them in the midst of your heart, for their life to those who find them, and health to all their flesh. Health and medicine. Keep your heart with all diligence, for out of it spring issues of life. Put away from you a deceitful mouth, and put perverse lips far from you. Let your eyes look straight ahead, and your eyelids look right before you. Ponder the path of your feet, and let all your ways be established. Do not turn to the right or the left. Remove your foot from evil. So the scripture tells us that we are to give attention to God's words. We're to pay attention to them. We're to keep them in our eyes. We're to keep them in the midst of our heart, because it's life and medicine to, to our all of our flesh. And I like what Derek Prince says, if all of your flesh is full of health, there's no room for sickness. So today, it's important for you to treat God's word as the incorruptible seed that it is. Sow it in your heart, pay attention to it, get it in your eyes, speak it, get it in your ears every day, and it'll start to change you from the inside out. And that's what biblical healing is. It starts from the inside, it starts in your heart, your spirit, man. And it begins to work into your, your soul. The Lord promised he would restore our soul. He's our shepherd, Psalm 23. He'll restore your soul if your soul is broken, if your soul is confused, if your soul is, if it's got problems. The Lord promised he would restore your soul. And then the word of God is health and healing to all of our flesh. So God's word starts from the inside out. And that's very important that obviously you have to believe with your heart. That's what the scripture says. We believe with the heart. And we confess with our mouth, with the heart man believes into righteousness, with, con with the mouth you confess into, confess into salvation. So what you believe will come out of your mouth. What the, Out of the abundance of the heart, the mouth speaks. So if you believe something, it's going to come out of your mouth. And I like to call that the hammer test, right? If you want to find out what's in your heart in abundance, hit your, hammer, your hand with a hammer. Not on purpose, of course. <laughs> but what comes out of your heart is what is really there. So if you want the word of God to be in your heart and to heal you, you need to get it in there so it will come out in abundance amen well god bless you guys i gotta run um but uh continue to to watch videos we got lots of videos on this channel um I, we're getting close to 100 episodes so i encourage you to share them with your friends somebody who's sick somebody who doesn't know jesus somebody who needs to see this um get it out there i'd really appreciate that um so anyway um when the when the subscription button comes up you can subscribe by hitting here or watch another video uh, but let me pray for you Heavenly Father I just thank you right now for my friends those who are watching whoever's watching wherever they're watching whenever they're watching I thank you for healing their bodies right now you said you sent your word and healed them so Lord I send your angels right now through this video in Jesus name to begin to minister life and health and healing Lord I pray for gifts of healings and miracles right now right now to flow through this video this YouTube channel and I thank you for doing it, Lord, that Jesus will be glorified. Lord, we just say it is done. The work was done on the cross 2,000 years ago. And Lord, we receive the healing power of God in our bodies right now. Spirit, soul, and body, be healed in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Thank you guys for listening. I kind of like this location. <laughs> this is actually pretty cool. Um, so anyway, uh, don't forget to subscribe and watch another video. See you guys soon. I could go meet my nephew.